Perja is a seaside resort on the Costa del Sol, in the region of Andalusia of Spain. It is the first resort town going away from Malaga to not be dominated by large ugly concrete hotels and is situated in the attractive foothills of the Sierra Almajara Mountains. Don't be misled by the tourist brochure descriptions of Nerja as a fishing village. Tourism is this town's main industry and the few fishermen with their boats still to be seen along the beach provide a picturesque scene for visitors and a slim livelihood for local families. Until the last decade the town retained a strong Spanish identity, but during recent years the influx of both northern European visitors and residents has eroded significantly the genuine charm of a truly Spanish working town. That said, compared to many other Costa del Sol destinations, especially to the west of Malaga, Nerja is still very much worth a visit. It is a quiet town with a central historical area that still feels like a village, and the tourist mix is not exclusively northern European as many Spanish people use this resort for holidays, together with French and Italians. Unsurprisingly, the relative peacefulness of the town along with the absence of high-rise developments along the coast or noisy nightclubs means many British people have retired here. The town is built on a hillside with a not-too-steep gradient and the sprawling center itself consists of an older part with white streets partly pedestrianized mainly to the east of the Balcón de Europa. The natural focus of the town and the venue for fiestas, but beyond the 17th century church and the Plaza Cabana more modern development takes over and it is in these areas that the town seems like any other recently developed Spanish Costa resort. See the balcony of Europe is a recently reconstructed promenade built out onto a natural headland in the center of town with spectacular views along the coast. Originally constructed around 1487 in the place of a former 9th century castle, the balcony today is the main focus for the town, with a tree-lined paseo surrounded by cafes and ice cream shops and frequented by street performers and the occasional concert. Granted, for all the attention tourist guides give to this place there's not much to do except look up and down the coast, but the views are spectacular. Beneath the overlook itself, a glass-walled restaurant offers the chance to eat in a sit-down setting while taking in the scenery, but you can expect a high price tag for the privilege. El Salvador Church Near the balcony of Europe, facing the plaza just around the corner from the balcony, is this attractive 17th-century church constructed in Baroque Mudahar style.